After much anticipation, voters approved a $37 million Bozeman Public Safety Center. MTN's Medeiros Babb talked with the city and county safety officials to find out their reaction. So we're really uh, grateful for the community support and uh, the strong show of support that we got uh, on election day and we're excited about the project. Both the county and the city have struggled finding a solution to the growing public safety need. Chief Steve Crawford says he is anxious to get out of the current Law and Justice Center. We've been in there 24 years, so more than the career of an officer, we've been in a deficient space and we've obviously outgrown that space and then it was also never designed for what we're using it for. So we're really excited about being able to do our jobs in a facility that was designed for that. The new facility will be located on city owned property on routes in between Tamarack and Oak. The building will house city police, fire, courts and victim services all under one roof. It's one of the things we talked about throughout this process is the relationships that we have with our uh, police department. It's the number one agency that we respond with uh, on a daily basis. So to have uh, the future kind of in front of us now and we can see it, uh, it's really exciting for the opportunities uh, that we know are out there. Gallatin County Sheriff Brian Gutkin said the first thing he did after hearing the news was call Crawford to congratulate him. You know, disappointed, obviously, because I wanted us to stay together, but, uh, you know, mixed feelings because I also i am happy for him and for the fire folks and the courts. Um, I thought it was pretty, pretty impressive that the city voters cared enough about them to take care of them. Gukin said now that the city has a new facility, it is vital the county find one as well. In Bozeman, Medeiros Bab, MTN News. Gallatin County Commissioners say the county is working on plans for a new facility that they hope to roll out soon. We'll be right back.